After the deaths of Tyree Nichols in Memphis and Darrell Williams, uh, who died in Raleigh police custody, people are renewing their calls for alternatives to policing. CBS 17's Joseph Holloway was in Durham to hear their message. Who keeps us safe? The group Durham Beyond Policing took its message to the front of City Hall Wednesday morning, calling on the city to end its shot spotter gunshot detection pilot program and reallocate that money for things like affordable housing and youth programs. Our people deserve to be treated with dignity instead of suspicion. The group claims Durham's unarmed crisis response team, HART, is not fully funded and is calling for additional money for the program. As I understand it, all of our city council is really excited about this program. And so keeping that momentum and seeing that something is working, right? Like they've been able to make these interventions in neighborhoods and people walk away feeling safe and held. We talked with Durham's mayor pro tem, Mark Anthony Middleton, who says Durham Beyond Policing is not telling the whole story. The heart program is fully funded. Uh, it will have everything it needs, and we base our decisions based upon staff recommendations, metrics, and science. Middleton says he also supports ShotSpotter, telling me that the technology is working. I did reach out to the police department. They tell me that they are still evaluating that technology. In Durham, Joseph Holloway, CBS 17 News.